Hey everybody, what's up? We're back with more Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Oh, whoops, that was the, uh, was the wrong thing to plug my headphones into. Where's my Elgato chat link? So I use an Elgato HDX 60X, or HD 60X, excuse me, to do my game capture off of the PlayStation 5. So I use their Chatlink Pro to connect my headset. Anyways, welcome back to the channel, guys. Thanks for joining us again for more of our Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma, Dark Arisen. Let's get after it here. Now, if I remember correctly, we were adventuring towards um, Hillcrest Knoll, I think. Dragoncrest Hill. I can't remember the damn name of the place. Um, but it's our next objective in the main quest. So, when last we spoke, we had stopped right here. I told you guys we'd be right back. And right after I shut the camera off, we got attacked by a bunch of wolves. And they were dire wolves too, so they were like really hard. So I used up most of my stamina items and a bunch of health items just defeating them. Wind Bluff Tower, huh? Okay. Let's see what's up in Wind Bluff Tower. Don't worry. I'm, I'm trying to keep focus. The fellow has to stay ready. Ready for it? Okay. The much celebrated Arisen. So Dario. I'd have well liked to see you slay the height. <laughs> Excuse me for yawning. We gotta turn the music down a little bit. Something like that. I think that'll balance out much nicer. Yeah. There. Grand Soren guards all the way out here doing training. Not the strongest foe, but powerless without supplies to live on. You have it the key to fit it. Okay. <gasps> Whew, that's death right there. Don't go down there. I wonder if you can levitate. Like use that levitation spell to get down there. Let's have a look at that rise in the land. Seems the two games to ring all branches with strongholds. I'm trying to keep focus. Fellow has to stay. Ha! So the other guy said too. Must have run out of dialogue options when I got to these guys. Hmm. Well, let's just explore and see if there's any kind of cool items here. That we can parkour our way to. Ah, it's treasure chest up high, of course. Chainmail. Oh, interesting. I bet that's good for one of my characters, but not gonna be good for me. Oh wow. Actually, a big upgrade for my shirt as far as physical defense. Magical defense goes down. Piercing resistance. Ah. Ruins my look, really. Can't wear it. This place is known as Hill Figure Man. <laughs> damn voice, dude. <laughs> oh, man. You know, the guy was messing with me when he created that pawn. We are messing around when he created that pawn. He's like, this is kind of really funny. People get this and they realize like this the is the view, voice. Right? Okay. What do we get from the check? Why can't we do anything with this? There you go. What's this? Well, I guess it was nothing. Man, just no fear up here. No fear up on the ramparts. Oh, that was cool. Double jump is such a nice mechanic. Can't jump out that window. Okay, let's keep going on to the hill now that it's nighttime. It's gonna be quite a bit more dangerous out. Veteran's Parapet. As well as the War Bugle. Okay.
know what that item was. Veteran's Paraffin. There we go. A charm imbued with the wisdom of a storied vet soldier. It uses double experience acquired from foes for a period of time. Nice. Oh, Blasto, what the hell? Oh, nice. We're definitely gonna use that. Okay, well, cool. That was a cool little find in here. Let's get out of here now and continue on to the knoll. Running out of mushrooms already. So I can't tell if it's becoming nighttime or it was night and now it's becoming daytime. Not enough to unite men's hearts as one. It's definitely just becoming nighttime. North Face Forest. We'll know it by the ruins as we draw near. The beasts of these parts are proving a greater challenge, to be sure. Harpies. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> we need some better weapons. <laughs> ah. job, Muad'Dib. I'm pretty sure that was you. And Max? I think it was one of you guys who's shooting those fireballs, but good job. Saved our ass right there. Let's turn on our lantern so we can see. Ah, uh, really? Is that a wolf I heard? Looks like it's up this way. farther we have to go. Okay, we're pretty much here. It's around here somewhere. They say in times long past, such hill figures were not uncommon. Oh yeah, that's a supposed to be a reason makes his home not far from here. Oh really? And there's a picture on the hillside there of a guy with a spear, it looks like. Him who knows that I know what he seeks to know, knows it well. While he who knows not, knows not what I know, or know not. <laughs> this guy. Congratulations on you. You have found the man you seek. I am, or was, perhaps like you, a child of man bound to the dragon. So is arisen. Well met, young <clears throat> arisen. I am he who was forged by the dragon. Okay, he's got the scar on his chest, too. Black hands and black feet. Check it out. That's pretty cool. 
So it's a hieroglyph of a soldier with a spear on a hillside. We finally arrived. There we have. Anything good? A rock. So you got in here is rocks, old man. Ancient scroll. Secret softener. Just guys look around and see what there is. There's something down here. Nice. Nice. Poor crystal. Poor crystal's huge. Fairy stone. And uh Dragon Forged knowledge would be of use to you, Elizabeth. And an outfit of balloon, whatever that was. Bliat. A garment that covers the entire body down to the knees offers decent protection despite its fabric. Huh. Okay. Well met, arisen of the present day. New forged link in the Grand Chain. You have come seeking meaning for that slate and the words it bears. There is none. None save that it brought you here to me. Huh. My form can be discerned only by the true arisen. Go now. Tell him that gave you the cipher of what you have heard here. <clears throat> Which is what? what? We didn't hear anything. Let us return to Grand Sorin with this news. The slate you bear hold, but take heart. Our meeting shall avail you better than any text could. My form can be discerned only by true arisen. I am the Dragonforge. Okay. This looks interesting. Mr. Dragonforge. Whatever the hell that means. My guy's just picking up items here. Not giving them to me. Is that what's going on? What kind of spears does he have? The throat cutters are terrible. Ugh. Yellow gators. Whatever. Two fairy stones. Give those to me. Where did you get these? You guys been taking stuff. I haven't realized it. So you gotta watch your pawns. They'll end up with items. So we're gonna put a port crystal out here so we can travel back whenever we want. Then let's go check out whatever's around here before we head back to Grand Soren. There's something drawn on uh, here. Great. See, now that we put that down, we can use one of our wake stones to travel, or not wake stone, but fairy stone to travel to it anytime we want. Let's go check out the grassy knoll and see what's up here. Hill figure knoll, that's what the name of it is. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I need some enchantment on me. Enchant me. There we go, we got some more out now. Oh man, we're running all sorts of stuff here. Okay, we're getting our location up though. Oh, this dino will pass me bad. This dino will pass me really bad. Get rid of these uh, corpses first. Ah, get rid of, whoops. Get rid of the zombies and then we'll take care of the dogs. See, I was barely doing any damage to him, and then as soon as I got light power, now we're doing some damage here. Better go get Max. Max is dead. Let go of me. The fire. Go. I just found the wake stone shard right there. It hates fire! The fire works well! Okay. We have triumphed! Ah, there's harpies? Oh, yeah. 
Herpes and more rolls. Oh, the advantage in the air. See, it's dangerous tonight. It's a all over all the time. See, there we go. Got a little bit of experience from that quest. I don't know how many direwolves there was, but. Ignore the comely face! Wow. Oh my god. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, I'll aid you at once. Let me go. Dead except for me, so we gotta just straight up get some guys back to life. Come on, horse, get up. Come on, Max, get up. Yeah. Nighttime is so hard. Alright, we're just 
just get ravaged out here. Get off of me. This is crazy. Okay. Stagger him. Dude, this is like a thirty minute battle out here. This has been like almost like 10 straight minutes of battle here. Jeez, let's get off. There's a whole other pack of time loops there. What the? insane guys that was like three packs of wolves two packs of harpies there was a zombie that got in there somewhere oh my god they have respawned now see how dangerous this is at night guys these guys all respawn well we're gonna be pretty burly after this trip No, more wolves, no. I don't want to deal with more wolves. We have triumphed. Open at them, sir. I just want to go up here and see what's up here at the spear. I'll heal you. Nothing 
something on this rock. This is getting too crazy. too epic. Let's run in here and reset that. Then we're just gonna, <laughs> if it's still dark, we're gonna fast travel. Back to Grand Sword. Restore your health. Leave it to me. I always seriously just sat up there and straight up fought for 20 minutes, guys. There's something drawn on the hill. Oh, I got a new, I got a wake stone. Nice. So we have one revive if we die. Let's use our eternal fairy stone. We're going to go back to Grand Soren. We'll turn this quest in. To Sir Maximilian. Meaning. Such a portrait stone. One can reach it from anywhere with the use of a magic item. What is she wearing, dude? Look at her outfit. Xena, the warrior princess. Erica, level 19. Nope, you're too level level. I just thought your outfit was cool. So quiet. Seems the castle walls are reached by a flight of stairs ahead. The guards do have much to learn. Ooh, skeleton key, that's good. You in here, Sir Maximilian? Not a text, you say? A cipher crafted to bring you to the Dragonforged. I see. If this man speaks true and is immortal, there's a fair chance he guided his grace as well. Be that the case, his words are well worth heeding, sir. Meet with him as time allows. With luck, he'll lead you to victory as well. I've gained a question. Nice, 10,000, 10,000. That's really good. It will be my honor to show you the ready charges for the worm hunt. The choice is yours. Yeah, let's go after sir, just straight up route monsters. Here are the details. We have urgent word from the stone of the southwest. A horde of goblins struck the fortress while it was still under repair, and they've claimed it. Though the hold is remote, its importance to our southern defenses is critical. We must reclaim it, and soon. The safety of the entire duchy rides on this matter. I would ask your help in resolving it. Let's get it on. My thanks, sir. I shall send word to the hold presently. I've sent some of the Duke's swords on ahead already. Meet them there and lend them your arm. I await good word of your success. <laughs> Confident, very confident in us. Okay. Well, we're definitely gonna go and hit the inn. 
<clears throat> and spend some vocational points, manage some inventory, turn it to daytime, all that kind of good stuff. So let's do all that right now. What's up here? Nothing. You made new weapons? You're an arisen, then. and you fight alongside the pawns, then, eh? They must need all manner of train. Me, iron and steel home to an end. The master works on. Well, hey, he's got some new stuff. Oh, no new daggers. No new bows. A few new items, but nothing that's really good for us. Feather cape. The master works all. Come again. <clears throat> Salomed was a scholar, the leader of a council of sorcerers. He was a genius, a luminary, until the day he went mad. He put the fruit of the council's research to the flame and disappeared. Aye, geniuses are so oft touched with madness. But enough of him. I care only about the tome he kept with him in his research. I would make it mine, sir. Even if it means sifting through the muck to find it. Well, that's what I'll do for you. Okay, let's go in here and rest up. <clears throat> I hear congratulations. Have your pick. Can you? What will it be today? Understood. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching this episode. Unlucky and the channel's game on. We'll just keep on gaming on. We'll come back and we'll play some more Dragon's Dogma, Dark Arisen. We'll start off by using our vocational points and upgrading our skills and everything like that. Then we'll continue on with the main quest and go defeat the goblins that have invaded whatever castle they're at right now. Right. Um, a clean bed. Thanks for watching. Peace. Oh, we adjust our inventory.